Okay, McLeish here, and uh, today we're going to be tending passenger side of a Malibu LS. Okay, now we spray some soap water on there. Make sure that you get it all over there. The reason why we're doing this is to get all the fuzzies off the windows. Make sure that you get both sides because on the outside you actually make the template for your window tent. The type of tint we're using is uh, Black Magic, 35%. We're gonna slap this bad boy on there. Now when you buy this stuff make sure that the staples are in place and make sure that you actually have a full roll because sometimes people return the rolls and they put it back up on the shelf and people have used it and you only have not even a full windows worth left. Okay first you spray your soapy water on there And you always want to make sure that when you first put it on the tent, it's at least an inch down. That way, you can actually get everything lined up perfectly going up into the door itself. And when you roll this out, you want to make sure that it's on the outside roll there. This side, this side goes down because this side is the actual sticky side. Wait, hold. Don't, don't crease it. Like I said, this is just a template. This is how you cut it out and everything. Make sure that everything is all golden. Soapy water makes it stick. You want to make sure that you have a nice sharp blade because if not, then you're just going to tear this off. To be able to get a nice fine edge, you want to make sure that it's nice and smooth. Smooth it out with the wedge there. Soapy water again. Makes it nice and easy to be able to move around and smooth out. We got this fucking idiot neighbors with their fucking dog. Their dog always runs away every frickin' day. And they always tell them, Oh, we got a treat, we got a treat. Look at that damn dog. Stupid as hell. Dumb as hell. These people, they, they chase these, they chase them down every time. No, no treat for the dog. But anyways, back to the tent here.
What's the dog's name? I have no clue, but the damn dog gets out every freaking week. Oh, yeah. They're always chasing this damn dog. Got a treat, got a treat. I'm gonna roll up. Now we gotta roll up the window Will you watch it? to be able to get the bottom layer there. But we gotta make sure that it doesn't crinkle when we roll it up. We lift up. Lift up and I'm rolling up. We gotta make sure that it doesn't crinkle when rolling it up here. Still good? Looks good. Good? Looks good to me. Alright, that's all we got. We got a little bubble right there, but it's okay. I just smoothed it out right there so she's alright. And now we can get the bottom layer. Like I said, this is all prep, so when we actually get it on the inside, it fits right nice. So now we cut it down on the bottom there. Pull her away now. Make sure that you get it up, cut all the way there so you don't screw it up. Okay, so now gonna take the roulette, the roulette off. spray the inside with soapy water again there. Then we gotta take off the clear coat on the actual tint here. And the way to do it is you get masking tape there and or scotch tape I mean and uh, get it on both sides. You get the water. You just pull it apart just like that. If it will stick. You gotta get it perfectly on that corner. There it goes, get, just like that. Get the water. So now we need the water because we're going to spray it. We're going to spray it right onto the tent actual so that spray it doesn't well. stick to itself. Okay, good, good. Take that off. Because if you don't spray it with this, it will stick to itself. Hold on. And yes, of course, them idiots are still looking for their dog. Spray the inside again there, because you want it real nice and soapy. If not, then it's just going to stick to itself and it's it's going to get all screwed up. You got to be very careful not to crinkle it. Okay, where you help me out? You crinkle it, it'll get all screwed up. Still good. Now we want to get it all smooth. Like I said, we cut it on the template on the outside, so all we need to do is line it up just like we did on the outside, and everything should come out perfect. More water. Like I said, you need to get it nice and soapy. If not, then it's going to be a bitch to work with. Now you get your wedge out there and you start spreading it out. Make sure that it's nice and smooth, especially on the top there because it's going right up into that seal. If you don't get all the bubbles and the creases out, it's going to ruin your tent right away. 
Okay, we're rolling it up, making sure that Good. no bubbles, creases, or anything up top on the weather stripping right there, and I don't see nothing. Looks pretty dang good. Looks pretty good, Kevin. Don't worry about the soapy water getting down in the door there. It won't matter. There isn't very much, to be honest with you. Just make sure that you get a nice, firm pressing on your wedge there, because if not, then you're just going to get a bunch of creases and bubbles. And if there is any bubbles that you cannot get out, poke it with like a needle or something. Get the air out. And you don't want to... Let the tent sit for too long before you roll down the window there because you will ruin it. He's just putting on that soap just so that he can use the wedge there. Now they're hopping in the car to chase the damn dog. They do this every frickin' time. Well, let's hope they find it. It's way the hell down there. Oh, hey, look. There's that damn dog. Came back. Look at that shit. Huh? Alright, so this is how uh, you do tent there. Came out pretty damn good. I don't say much. So myself there, pretty dang good. So this is another Kay McLeish Productions. Please like, subscribe, comment, thanks.